as our WWE superstars are jockeying for position. Going into the upcoming pay-per-view event, we welcome you tonight to Monday Night Raw. Without question, one of the most anticipated episodes of Monday Night Raw in the history of WWE. And we're starting this card off with some fireworks. Let's do this. Don't go anywhere. Now, don't go anywhere. We have a classic coming up. We have one of our breakout talents taking on some tough competition. Enough hype. Let's get it on. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by The Bull. And from Gomez Palacio, Durango, Mexico, weighing in at 215 pounds. Sounds Graham to me, guys, Mira. like this crowd is ready to get this night started. They're not the only ones, Cole. It seems to me that these superstars want nothing more than to get their hands on one another. You ready for a Lucha House party? Yeah, I am. Byron, you know why Metalik wears that mask? Oh, why, Corey? In Mexico, he owes a lot of people a lot of money. I find that hard to believe. Byron, you should try it on. And his opponent, from Guadalajara, Jalisco, Mexico, weighing in at 175 pounds, Grand Metalik. The king of the ropes, Grand Metalik is here, baby. Grand Metalik, otherwise known as the king of the ropes, one of the most exciting superstars in the cruiserweight division. As ugly as he is talented. What you, uh, enough, Corey. Come on. This is the type of battle that you can show someone who's new to our brand of entertainment and say, this is what WWE's all about. And this is one of those matches where it's hard to believe we get paid for this. Well, actually, it's hard to believe Saxton gets paid for anything. Thank you. 
You gotta believe this one's over. <laughs> that could dislocate your shoulder. Sharp knee. He's starting to show signs of fatigue. He's really going to need to create some space for himself. struggling a bit here. I'm not sure how much more he has to give. That confidence he had on his face at the start of this match sure oh, has man. disappeared and for good reason. He's taken quite a beating. Contest has the victor. Let's take another look at these guys in action. Here is your winner, Graham Guillermo. Big win here to start the show. Yeah, the performance put forth in that match tells me we're looking at somebody who will someday, very soon, be competing in the main event. Happy 4th of July, everybody. I sure hope you enjoyed those fireworks. One match is in the books, and we're on to the next. Tag team match on the way. When we return, it's a battle where the participants will need to know where they are at all times. We have a team led by one of the best talents on the roster to date. In a match for the record books. Big time matchup.
ring at a combined weight of 260 pounds, the world, the one, Karen Owen. And, Owen. and guys, allow me to say thank you to everybody watching at home for spending part of your Independence Day with us. Congratulations, Cole. I thought for sure you were going to say some corny cliche about there being fireworks in this upcoming match. You showed a lot of reserve there. Very good job. That's Byron's job. <laughs> For me, it'll be interesting to see if the champ's approach changes any, considering the title is not on the line tonight. I don't know, Michael. Part of me thinks he'll fight this fight just like it was any other, regardless of what's at stake. folks as we kick off this tag team oh, match man. guys there's nothing like a good old-fashioned tag team match harsh impact When a superstar is in a tag team match and has endured heavy amounts of punishment, they must find a way back to their corner to tag their partner. Something that they have to try is doing create separation between them and their opponent. That space gives a superstar the ability to move and catch their breath. Vertical suplex! Nice! The end may be near, folks. Unless this thing turns around here, this tag team match is all but over. He has got to fight back. Corey, you touched on this before. Part of a tag team's ability to be successful is their ability to endure punishment and make their way to their partner when they need to tag out. One way to do that is to create that separation you spoke of so they have some space to gather themselves and time to make their way back to the corner. You're absolutely right, Michael. What's the use of having a tag team partner if you're not able to get to them when you got to tag out of the match? Getting that separation is key in breaking any momentum your opponents could have may be the difference between a win and a loss. Maybe even more. 
Most of the truly great tag teams in sports entertainment created a double team finishing maneuver. The spike pile driver from Anderson and Blanchard, the heart attack from the Heart Foundation, the rocker dropper from the Rockers, or the doomsday device from the Road Warriors. A team needs to have a tag team finisher and be able to execute that finisher on all types of opponents. A few moments ago, you mentioned some of the great tag team finishing moves in sports entertainment history. Don't forget about the 3D from the Dudley Boys or the double drop kick from the 2017 WWE Hall of Famers, the Rock and Roll Express. In tag team action, like in singles competition, once a duo nails their opponent with their finisher, that should signal the beginning of the end. It can take a long time for a tag team to decide on a double team finisher, but I think a team needs one, and it should be something that can be administered to any opponent. That's when a finishing move is truly effective. And since we're talking about tag teams, remember you and your partner have until the referee's five count to execute the move. What a stop! Good grief! Oh, that's the impact. tag team contest. Whenever tag team is on the docket, the mayhem multiplies. Here's the proof. He was on point the entire match, as you can see here. Three, three count ends this one and there's your winner folks i don't care how many wins you have whenever your hand is raised in victory a certain level of excitement washes over you and it'll be interesting to see the ripple effects this win has in the weeks to come Another great matchup is now on tap. Singles action coming your way. Singles action is up next. You're not going to want to miss this. We have a real fan favorite taking on some tough competition. Let's do it.
making his way to the ring from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 206 pounds, the heavyweight Lucha Libre World Champion, the Superstar Champion. Byron, is there a chance he gives less than 100% here tonight, given the fact that the title is not up for grabs? Well, if he does, I can tell you that he's going to get embarrassed here. Title match or not, you simply cannot give less than 100% each time you step inside that ring. Hey guys, this is an incredibly important match for the champion. Yeah, that's right, Cole. Despite the title not being on the line, the last thing he wants to do is show any sort of weakness here because you can bet there are guys in the back studying his every move. there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. And he's a proud guy. That title may not be on the line here, but that doesn't mean he doesn't want to win this match. <laughs> oh, man! He looks a bit off his game here. I fully expect him to bounce back, though. This is the type of one-on-one -on -one atmosphere where he thrives. changes if he wants to stay in it. He's not looking at himself right now, and I hate to say it, but this might be the beginning of the end for him here. Lightning fast reflexes. Ooh, what impact. Bam! What a slam! Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Beautiful technique. Ooh, there's the kick. Second row. The Panama Sunrise. That should do it. How about another look at some of the highlights?
Here is your winner, the Superstar. A very decisive victory here tonight. Any way you slice it, that win right there is beyond important. Happy 4th of July, everybody. I sure hope you enjoyed those fireworks. Another great matchup is now on tap. Singles action on tap right now. Singles action is up next. You're not going to want to miss this. We have a real fan favorite taking on some tough competition. Going to settle the score. Making his way to the ring from Annapolis, Maryland, weighing in at 145 pounds, King. And guys, if you're looking for fireworks on this 4th of July, you came to the right place because this match will be nothing short of explosive. Come on, Cole. You're better than that. Did you really have to go with the fireworks line? Oh, come on. Who am I kidding? Of course you did. Shifting gears now, I'd like to take this opportunity to wish everybody a very happy 4th of July. And if you're into fireworks, don't touch that remote because this one is sure to be explosive. Ugh, who writes your stuff?
and runs away. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. Harsh impact. He's starting to stumble here. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. I guarantee you that the post-game show on the WWE Network will be talking about how he struggled getting out of the game here tonight. Oh, perfect kick. Looks like he's starting to tire. He doesn't want to absorb much more punishment if he wants to win this match. Yeah, I'm sure he saw things going differently for him here tonight, but that clearly isn't the case, unfortunately for him. Spinning kick to the gut. Nope, reverses it. He's looking incredibly fatigued right now. He may very well be on Dream Street right now, guys. He is hurt. High impact crossbody. Oh, man. Spinning kick to the gut. No, he reverses it. Looking for the exclamation point. Power bomb. This one's over, guys. He's in trouble. Going for the big one. Nailed it. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? He releases it. And you can debate whether or not that would have been the end. Interesting decision there. Going to the top, high risk. Look at this. Drop down. What a close line. Ouch. He's going for it all. Incoming. for the finish.
this one's over. Oh no. He's docking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Look at him! Drop the shoulders. Down! Samoan driver! This is his opportunity to win this thing. Here's the cover. One very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point. Not yet. Too early. Despite having an impressive spot in this week's power rankings, I'm told this superstar isn't all concerned with things like that. Wow, I thought he was a goner. He's starting to feel it here. He's going to want to make sure this doesn't snowball out of control. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Cole. This is just a little bump in the road for him here. Nothing to worry about. Double chicken with the suplex. Vicious knee. You're tuned in to Monday Night Raw live and in high definition. Drop down. Oh boy, he is rolling. Knocked him right off his feet. Yeah, no kidding. He's looking at it. Absolutely spiked. DDT. If that doesn't end it, I don't know what will. I think that slam caught us all off guard. Impressive combination kicks. You gotta love that kind of aggression. There may be no escaping this fireman's carry. I don't know. Never say never, bro. when everything's clicking for you. And I'd say this superstar's last match was one of those nights. Uh-oh, here we go. Oh, sleeping with the fishes. <laughs> this one is over. Back now inside the ring. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. When you talk about nights where everything just seems to be clicking, you can't help but think about the magical night Daniel Bryan had at WrestleMania 30. Yeah, that's right. Not only did he defeat Triple H in the first match of the night, but he also went on to bookend the card with a... He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Look at these two giving it their all. There's absolutely no quit in them tonight. Pull line! Bad move there. I don't know what made him think that was a good idea.
A lot of people are questioning how this superstar got such a favorable spot in this week's power rankings. But not to me. Seems perfectly logical. Byron, he looks like he has no idea where he is. Yeah, he is definitely on Dream Street, Michael. He wants no part of the outside. At what point do those thoughts creep in? Of, when this guy's on, look out. He's stumbling some now. You have to wonder if he could recover from this, guys. But the question is, how much energy does his opponent have left? My guess is not much, given what we've seen him go through so far in this match. Filthy German suplex. Oh, boy, he is rolling. We know it's coming here. Oh, the old sleeping with the fishes. <laughs> Just when you thought he had nothing left. Four. He wants no part of the outside. Five. High cross body. Harsh impact. These athletes seem to have tried everything in their playbook. Oh, there's more in their arsenal, I promise you that. I don't know what it is, but they'll find it. He goes down hard. Yeah, and he's not looking very good at this point, Cole. He looks for it once again. Beautiful technique. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Whoa, he lets him out. What a fool. He had him dead to rights. If you're this superstar, you gotta be happy about where you're listed in the recent power rankings. Just a step quicker, it looks like. Oh, he turns it around. Him up. Oh, what incredible power. Wow, what a vertical suplex. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Look out. Boom, what impact. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. And if he hits this, this one's over. Power bomb. He's got him covered. These superstars have tried everything. 
They have something left in their arsenal. They have to, but can they dig down deep enough to find it? Too quick for him there. He might have it. Guys, let's go to the replay. Yeah, I definitely need to see that again. The end may be near. Chaos, melee, pandemonium. Russian leg sweep. This might be it. Oh, my. Effectively using the knee. What a strike. The longer this fight goes on, the more wear and tear on each competitor. Who is going to have enough to pick up the win? Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh boy, he is rolling. I really can't believe what's gone down so far. This match has been even more physical than I thought it would be. There he goes, crashing to the floor. One more look at it. Ah, oh, the old sleeping with the fishes. <laughs> wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. You're not going to win many matches absorbing punishment like that. Boom, right the button. We have seen him here before. Oh, that's what he was looking for, Michael. The pressure is too much. They tap. Now let's get another look at some of the high points of that one. I could watch highlights of that one all night long. One of the great WWE matches I've ever been able to watch. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic. Here is your winner, Ashley. That's an impressive win right there. Great effort from both these guys, Michael. I'm willing to bet this isn't the last time we see them square off. Happy 4th of July, everybody. I sure hope you enjoyed those fireworks.
I can't wait to see how the rest of the card shakes out here. What a night. Making his way to the ring from Mexico City, Mexico. Weighing Guys, we have two of WWE's most exciting pounds, superstars ready to square off here. Champion. And there's nothing quite like seeing Magic. two superstars settling it in the ring in one-on-one -on -one action, Michael. Byron, you ready? Richard and his opponent, from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 168 pounds, Kalisto! One-on-one -on -one action coming up here, guys, and I'm willing to bet this will be one we won't soon forget. Totally agree, Michael. When you have two superstars as hungry as these two competing in the ring, you can bet It'll be memorable. This should be an incredible matchup. I mean, both men have extensive offensive repertoires, lasting endurance. Penny predicament. His shoulders are down. Early kick out. Referee right on top of the action. It's going to take more than that. trouble here. He needs to create some space and find a way to get back on the offensive. And he's been gambling quite a bit here tonight. There's plenty of reward that goes along with being outside the ring as much as he has been, but there's a ton of potential risk. I think a lot of people right now are scratching their heads wondering how he let this match get so out of hand. the impact what a stop good grief uh oh watch out oh, impactful 
slam. He's a long way from a three count, I can tell you that. Not yet. He's making a statement here with this attack. Wow. Here we go. And what a reversal from Kalisto. Down he goes. That'll do it every time. Set him up. You gotta believe this one's over. Drop kick right on point. Might as well run for cover when Kalisto's rolling like this. Harsh impact. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Ooh, what impact. He had nothing left. This night could be over for Kalisto. Looking for the win. Oh, continuing to punish them. That's what he was looking for, Michael. He had it locked up and made his opponent tap out. And here's a look back at some of the action from the previous match. These guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire, as these highlights show very well. This match wasn't exactly a barn burner, but we can't expect every superstar to be on their A game every time, I guess. Here is your winner, Magic. And there's your winner via submission. You know, nothing made me happier than when I'd lock in Lucky 13 and make my opponents tap out. Guys, it sounds like we can all agree that was an extremely impressive win. Another great matchup is now on tap. Singles action coming your way.
making his way to the ring from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 176 pounds, the underground champion, the Eagle O. Todd Gould. And very quickly, I can tell you that these superstars are very excited to have the opportunity to compete here tonight on Independence Day. And similarly, we're excited to be able to call the action for you, especially for this match. This is going to be great. From Cameron, North Carolina, weighing in at 225 pounds, the superstar. There is an absolutely big fight feel in the arena tonight for this one. Yeah, and judging from the vibe here currently, it seems to me like this is the one this sold out crowd came to see. electricity running through this arena. This is going to be some battle, one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano. If you haven't hit record yet, now Ouch. might be a good time to do that. These guys are gonna have a match you'll wanna watch over and over again. Spinning kick in the gut. And unfortunately for him, there was no water in the pool. Atomic drop! Oof! Oh, man! Ooh! Beautiful technique. sweat now but he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has to do to rebound Hooked up. Delivering the 
shin breaker. Drop down. Oh, what a close line. Forcefully delivered. spot for him to be in. He's got to figure out a way to get back in it, guys. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> He's making a statement here with this attack. <laughs> Irish whip. Uh, setting him up in position here. On oh, the second. Yeah. DDT. Chicken wing up and out. What a good buster. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match. Shoulders on the mat. What is keeping this competitor going? I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Going for broke. Oh, what a kick to the face. Oh, my God. Just when you thought he had nothing left. Here's a cover. One, two, three. There's the pin. It's over. It's all over. Let's take another look at these guys getting after it. I know the match was solidly entertaining, but I really hope these guys would take it to the next level. Regardless, nobody's asking for their money back. Here is your winner, the Eagle O. Todd Gould. And there's your winner here in this singles match. To get the pinfall victory over such a high quality opponent is incredibly impressive, Michael. As we close the book on this match, I need to remind everybody just how big of a win this was. Simply amazing. Finally, the main event. Singles action on tap right now.
making his way to the ring from Vancouver, British Columbia, weighing in. Guys, it'll be interesting to see if the champ's approach pounds, changes any here tonight. I doubt it, Cole. I can see why somebody might think yeah. that, given that this is a non title match. But let's not forget, the champ is still interested in winning matches. It's not like he's going to take the night off just because his title's not on the line. And his opponent, from Queens, New York, weighing in at 180 pounds, the Spider, Peter Parker. Shifting gears now, I'd like to take this opportunity to wish everybody a very happy 4th of July. And if you're into fireworks, don't touch that remote because this one is sure to be explosive. Ugh, who writes your stuff? As we get underway, I'm expecting a hard-fought match between these two superstars. The first one to make a mistake could fail. And this is one of those matches oh, where it's hard to believe we get paid for this. Well, actually, it's hard to believe Saxton gets paid for anything. Oh, and a backbreaker! Right to the spine. This could be all she wrote. Incredible impact. But did he go for it too early? That'll readjust your spine. He's on the defensive now. He doesn't want to let this match get out of control, guys. He's really starting to look fatigued here, guys. And when that happens, your whole body starts to give out on you. He's going to need to be careful here. He has to be disappointed in this performance. He really is so much better than what he's shown so far tonight. He's looking very overwhelmed out there. There may be no coming back from this. Oh my goodness, this hurts! Oh! Game, set, match, this one is over. You don't get stretched like that and expect to walk the same way. Is it. And you can debate whether or not that would have been the end. Interesting decision there. The bionic elbows. <laughs> over uh, and over. There he goes. Crash. 
crashing to the floor. He's out there in no man's land. And got to find a way to get the safety call. I'm not sure he can. Good God, what a knee. He wants no part of the outside. Putting it all on the line. In coming. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Oh, nasty impact. Shake on that one. Hold on, guys. This isn't good. No question about it, Cole. Burning hammer. Burning hammer. Oh, boy, he is rolling. He might have it. Lights out. DDT connects. I'm not sure how much he has left. That's worth another look. Yeah, I want to see that again. Here he goes. I well, that's not right. Somebody do something about that. This one's over, guys. Up against the barrier now. I think that barrier might be the only thing holding him up. I think you're right. Five. A torturous knee. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Cutting it close here, guys. What a coward. He's trying to get himself counted out, Cole. Not today. Eight. Nine. Back in from the floor. This is not how you want to see a matchup like this end. A lot of action in that match. Let's have a look. Some pretty good give and take in this match, as these highlights show. These guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire, as these highlights show very well. No doubt about it, he brought his A game, as you can see here. Official decision is a count out. Oh, come on. That's garbage. Nobody wants a count out. Get them back in the ring and let's restart this thing. Happy 4th of July, everybody. I sure hope you enjoyed those fireworks.